Most websites are designed to be seen by the public. However, there are several reasons why you might want to make your site private or limit your audience. It's for a school assignment. It's an online resume or portfolio that you don't want someone to copy or plagiarize. Or the site contains personal or private information about you or others. You can control the privacy settings by clicking on the Share icon in the top tool menu in Google Sites. If you want to give someone viewing privileges for your site, your professor for example, add their email address and make them a published viewer. You can write them a message to let them know that you're sharing the site with them. If you want to add someone as an editor, a group member for example, simply add their email address and select the editor option for them. Once you've added specific viewers and or editors, you can adjust the privacy settings for your site. This is done in the links section of the share with people and groups pop-up. Click on Change in the Link section. Drafts should be restricted to you and those in your group. Published should be set to Restricted if you only want your named viewers to see the site. If you want the public to see your site, for example for an online portfolio, then choose the Public setting. Please note these settings can be changed whenever you want you can make a private site public or a public site private at any time. To publish your site and make it viewable, click on Publish in the top right-hand corner. You will be prompted to give your site a name. There is a chance that the website name that you choose might already have been used. If so, try a variation. Please note, you can also set your privacy settings from this page. And you can also request to have search engines not display your site. To make your website live, click on Publish. From now on, anytime you make a change to your website, you will have to click on Publish again. Google Sites will show you a preview of the changes, for example if you deleted a page, before you make your changes go live.